Let's take a look at a classic single displacement reaction, copper two sulfate and iron. We're going to coat part of my hammer with solid copper. It's going to look really nice. First, we need to make a saturated solution of copper two sulfate. The blue color that you see forming as it stirs around, that's the copper. Those are copper ions. We're going to replace those in the solution with iron. So we put the hammer into that solution of copper two sulfate and we can see the single displacement reaction take place right away. It's really quick. So the iron, it's replacing the copper. We start out with this copper sulfate dissolved in water. That's the blue and the iron from the hammer that replaces some of the copper in that blue solution in the beaker. The copper now it's on the hammer. We could also put some of the copper two sulfate on the side of the hammer. Watch how it starts out blue and then that blue color quickly goes away. We let it react for just a second and then when we wipe it off, you see that copper there? That was the blue color, but now it's on the hammer. All of this makes sense. Iron, Fe, it's higher than copper on the activity series, so it should replace copper. So where's the iron now? Well, it's dissolved in the water. It's replaced the copper. That's why that blue color went away. Copper's on the hammer. And that iron, it's FeSO4 aqueous. It's dissolved in the water. If we evaporated the water, we'd see crystals of FeSO4. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.